Good morning, Ms. Schneider's class. Today's Art with Autumn project is going to be this beautiful pencil box. So look in the packet that we gave you. You'll find a Ziploc bag full of stickers and goodies. Get your wiggles out and let's find a nice clean place to do an art project. All right, Ms. Schneider's class, let's get started. First, in your packets, I've included a piece of construction paper, some colored paper, Pull that out. That's going to be the base of our project. Then we also have a round disc that we're going to set our pencil case on. We have our toilet paper roll. Then we have our stickers. We want to make sure you get out of all the stickers. Now I included as many stickers as I could find in the classroom. But if you have more stickers that you'd like to use at home, you're welcome to use those stickers as well. Make sure you also have out your crayon. And let's see, and your glue stick. And then let's get started. So we have our colored paper here. And we're going to take each of you, I gave you the very first letter of your name. I noticed that my good friend, Miss Kayla, doesn't have a pencil box, so I'm gonna make a pencil box for my friend today, and you are gonna make one for yourself. So Miss Kayla's name starts with a K. So I'm gonna peel off my K here. Hopefully yours comes off easier. <laughs> this is live video, folks. Okay, so we have our K, I'm gonna put the K right about here on my construction paper, as you can see. And now I'm going to write the rest of Miss Kayla's name nice and small right there. I don't want to write too big because when you fold it in half, you'll lose some of the name. So I think Miss Kayla would look really good in red. So we're going to write an A, an E, an L, and an A for Miss Kayla. Now is the fun part. We are gonna take our stickers and we're gonna decorate all over the place. All right, so I have some special dot stickers here. I think I'll put some around here. I know I found some American flag stickers and flowers and baseball. I tried to come up with some of your favorite things. Let me turn this this way so you can see. I think that um, that way when you look at your pencil box, you get all excited about all of your favorite stuff. And take your time. If you'd like to draw on the pencil box, you have all of these crayons. You could put on hearts. You could do stars. In fact, there's a really fun, easy way to draw a star. You just make a line down like this. And then you make a little X, makes a little star shape. I'm trying to think of all the things that I know my friend Miss Kayla likes. Let's give her a pretty rose. I hope I got all of your favorite things on there. I know I know all you, don't know all of you that well yet, so I tried to guess. But who doesn't love some music notes and sparkly things? I always think the sparklier the better. So hopefully our friend Miss Kayla will love this. So our very next thing that we're going to do is attach it to our toilet paper roll. So what we're going to need now is our glue stick and our toilet paper roll. So I have my colored paper and I'm gonna put it face down like this and take my glue stick and I'm gonna go all over the, all over the paper. It might be a little bumpy because you have stickers and stuff on the other side. So take your time. You wanna make sure you get really well. The most important place to get glue is all around the edges because you want the, the um, paper to stick really well to your paper roll. So now we have our paper roll and we are just gonna set it down. So grab, your toilet paper roll and we're going to set it down and we're just going to roll it and make sure that our design goes on nice and 
flat. And now we have a little key, a little box for Miss Kayla. And what we're going to do next is take some glue and we're going to put glue on this base like this here and set that down. And you might want to put a little a heavy book or even a bowl on top of it for just a little bit so the glue will set and it'll work really well to hold all your pencils and your crayons and your scissors. This has been pretty fun. Come back next week and we'll have another art.